fingers down there and I find the aorta. I'm usually about three, four centimeters above the umbilicus when I do it. And then once you find it under your fingers, find one edge of it, okay? So if we had, if here's his belly, and I felt it right there, I'm going to basically go to the, kind of put my fingers there and then eventually move to one direction when I feel it the strongest and then when I don't feel it as strong and then go back to that patient's left side till I feel it the strongest and I kind of do that with one finger then where it's the strongest I hold my finger there and then I kind of do the opposite side where it's the strongest and then where it's not and get back so my finger should eventually be able to find the strongest point so it kind of looks like this I go down and I feel it and so now I kind of work out with my right hand I'm working outward to find its strongest point and then I can do the same with my left hand and then I would measure the distance between that's it you can do it with two fingers a lot of us just do it with bilaterally with our hands and so we're trying to get those that's fingers right. normally it's three to four centimeters Yes. So you just, you find the strongest point and then you just keep filling out until what you like don't feel it as well? Well, when, when it goes from strongest to not strong and then you go back to strongest, that's usually the edge. Okay, so you're on the edge of one. And then you go to the other side and you go strongest here, it's not as strong, find those edges, find that strongest point. So the more your fingers can go apart but it's still strong, that's going to be your width. And between the two should also be just as strong. Yeah. So yes, it's like absolutely. Feeling. Yeah, we got a big vessel there that will palpate. Okay. Yeah, and on an obese person, those those vibrations come all a little bit more wide. So it's going to feel wider because they're they're transmitted through the fat pretty easily, and so it it could be a little bit deceiving. On a fairly thin person, it's you can get right down in there and pretty much get on the edge of it. I have a question.